a marvelous sight. The white flakes blustering in the air this night. Lil Arsen feels a chill from the cold, but only warmth in your presence, friend. It is good to see one more like us so far from elsewhere. The norths of Skyrim are chilly like their land. A Khajiit is a welcome face. Are you an adventurer? Minarsen knows there are many adventurers in this place. Nilarsen is no adventurer. No, Nilarsen is a cutter of hair, a styler of fur, the best in Tamriel. I wash and cut your fur for no coin if you like. This one thinks you need it. No offense is meant to you, my friend. Khajiit knows it is not possible to find proper grooming here in this land of north. This one sees Khajiit come through, looking as rough and shaggy as saber cats. But Linarzen fixes them all. No worries, good as new. For Linarzen is the best barber in Tamriel. What is a barber doing all alone upon this mountainous tundra? Friend, do you know of Alfden? The dwarves built it thousands of years ago, deep down beneath this one's tent. Now, this city of the dwarves sleeps in ruin, except for the farmer, the and wonders what our new friend was doing so far north of civilization, if not for pursuit of the vast treasures within. Few ever come to Alfden for the danger of death and dismemberment are great. Those that do only take the risk for the promise of treasures within. Larsen is no treasure hunter. No, this one has no delusions of reaching such riches of legend. It is better, we think, to keep the skin on our back. Larsen has come here to trap the creatures called Chores, which the vile Falmer keep like shells of these creatures are very hard, like armor. Lilarsen thinks, how can a creature grow a shell so smooth, so supple, and yet so strong? Lilarsen thinks, perhaps the shell is of the same make and kind the claws and the fur and nails and hair. Perhaps if Lilarsen can get a sample, we can distill its essence into a shampoo of magnificent volumizing power. Lilarzen has always been a genius barber. Our mother was long of hair and required Lilarzen to
to snip and trim away her luxurious mane. This one's mother was Alfik, you see. Like this one's father. And all of our brothers and sisters. There are five of us, but only Lilarzen was not born under a wasning master. And so only Lilarzen is a cafe. A strange thing it is to grow so tall, and yet also to walk upon two legs, when all my family are so little and shy of speech. This one could hold all seven of them at once, if only they would stay still enough for Larsen to try. You seem as if you have been through much, Kajit. Its fur is long and shaggy, and Larsen sees sleepfulness in your eyes. There is bad stiffness in your muscles, stiff like this sap inside the tall bristly thigh pine trees when the days grow so cold. The Narzen has seen these things. The sap freezes inside. The Lars and wonders if the trees ever freeze so tightly they shatter. The Lars and wonders if you have heard of such a thing. This one does not want to see our new friend shatter. Please stay with us. The fire is warm as the sun, and this tent is an oasis of cold. Larsen will share food and drink. This one has a jar of sweet egg custard dumplings, which we must only heat. The Norse do not cook with much sugar. This one has found to great displeasure. They like the bitter drink. The salted meat, the acrid root and leaf. The sweet rolls that they make are not so sweet at all. Lilarsen finds that the Nords love no sweet thing except skooma. This is sad. With you, Lilarsen will share these very special treats and they steaming hot pot of honeyed spiced wine. All the comforts of home and the free trim and styling on the house. The Larsen asks no coin from you, friend. We are overwhelmed with happiness to see a familiar face on this cold evening. Let the Larsen pamper no objections. Sit down and relax. I will go get my instruments.
is a bone comb made from the wings of bone hawks from the northeast of solitude. These animals appear to be undead, but they hunt as immortal.
some of their glistening, mysterious scales. Though, if you ever come across one, Kashita's coin, if you will sell.
secret to a sharp blade is an Orsimer blacksmith. Blacksmith? Can she excel in all things? But why should Kajit care for blades when they have claws so sharp? Orcs have no claws and so must make
For now. 